It's a sound all too common during Texas summers. These pests, mosquitoes, are just something we have to live with. They're a very persistent thing, especially in high humidity environments. Dauphin Ewart, CEO of the Bugmaster, gets calls from all over Central Texas to tame the bugs. What we're trying to do is just keep the population as low as possible. While treatments can be an incredibly important part of improving the environment, they don't make it zero. His team works on reducing mosquito breeding sites and cutting down their population, but it isn't easy. Mosquitoes can breed in a surprisingly small amount of water. Those combating mosquitoes say Texas might have less of the pests flying around this summer because of the insanely hot and dry conditions. It doesn't mean that they're not there. So there are still mosquitoes. I would still take precautions. Daniel Markowski with the American Mosquito Control Association has been studying the insects for decades. He says the best way to protect communities from the many diseases mosquitoes can carry, like West Nile, is a surveillance program where cities can keep track of infected mosquitoes. Many times you're, you're able to respond before there's a major outbreak of disease. You see fewer human cases than in areas where you don't have that type of program. Bell County has a program of its own, and on Wednesday, the department reported its first human West Nile case of 2023, just weeks after a mosquito tested positive for the virus. For most people who can contract the virus, um, about 8 out of 10 people um, who get infected, they're not going to develop any symptoms. Dr. Cesar Medina with the Waco McLennan County Public Health District says it's possible for you to have flu-like symptoms, and there is a chance for it to be more threatening by attacking the central nervous system. If they don't take the proper basic prevention methods, then, then they can, that can definitely uh, increase their susceptibility. Well, experts say this month and into September is when we can expect more reports of human West Nile virus cases to come out. You can combat mosquitoes by using bug repellent and draining standing water because those are the areas that they love, y'all. They just hang out there and then they come and attack us. Yeah. And if you have standing water right now, I you're know. really negligent. Yeah. <laughs>